YouTube. In this video, I am going to review Paranoid Android ROM for OnePlus 3. If you go to settings menu, about phone, you can find I am using Paranoid Android version 6.0.1, which is based on the Android version 6.0.1. So, is Paranoid developers are always known for their polished and more smooth ROMs. So, let's go and check out what they are offering for the OnePlus 3. So, well, let's go and check out the notification panel. This is the notification area. You can see all the tables as well as brightness control. If you click on battery icon, you can go to the battery settings. Here you can change the battery icons to circle or whatever it is. And the battery saver option is there as well as battery optimization. And then we have battery percentage. If you want to see battery percentage inside the icon, you can go do that also. So is that in the notification area, if you want to add some more tiles, you can see the tiles are here. Some more tiles are here. You can uh, drag and you can drop it anywhere. If not, you can remove. So is that we have multi-user option. And if you go to the settings menu, you can find all the regular CM-based ROM options here. In this section and then in the display, you can find brightness level, adaptive screen, and uh, press power button twice for the camera. So that is working fine. Fingerprint also working. Fingerprint camera is also uh, very fast, as usual. And then ambient display, daydream. These are the regular settings. And then sounds, you can see all the regular settings only. In buttons, you can, uh, if you want the navigation button, you can go for this one. Swap keys, swap slide mode, so you can swap the options of the slide, the alert slider backlight and then you can customize the home button, back button and reasons button, actions for all these. And then we have uh, gestures, double tap to wake up is there, one finger swipe up, you can customize one finger, swipe up what to do, one finger swipe down. So you can, there are many gestures you can do on the screen of gestures. These are the screen of gestures, so these are some, some of the additions you can do rather than the oxygen eyes. So it's a great collection so you can play with those gestures and apps, storage, battery memory uses, ambient displays here if you want to turn on the ambient display you can uh, do it. So this is the ambient display and then we, we have this theme so you can download any Sanagen CM theme based uh, themes here. So that's the beauty of the size of ROMs anyway. And other details are like uh, regular details you used to find on all the size of mode based ROMs. Uh, besides that we have this dialer, messenger and then chromium browser. This is the chromium browser. If you go to about phone you can find uh, this is the chromium browser. Impilled and then camera. Camera is like very neat not so many features but uh, you can customize all the aspects from here HDR mode, portrait, landscape, sports all the options are on the left side and then you can play with the filters swap camera and then you have beautification and uh, other settings you can do here and camera is uh, fast as usual no issues with the camera It says that if you open the menu, you can find uh, gallery. So this is the building gallery. Which is pretty neat. So basically, this is it. As I said earlier, this is like more polished and um, more battery-friendly ROM for the OnePlus 3. If you are using it, we can easily get around. Uh, almost uh, 5 hours of uh, screen on time if you are using this ROM rather than the other ROMs. And if you want to know how to install this ROM onto OnePlus 3, just check out the link below. I'll provide the link in the description. That's it guys. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more.